Hi guys, welcome back to episode 3 of FNAF World here. Um, basically, I was going to tell you guys I did lose the save file again. Um, but this time it wasn't my fault, this time the hard drive failed on my computer. So, we do have a different save file here. But, same thing I did last time. Um, we're up to the same point in the game, so it doesn't really matter. So, let's just go with this team for now and see what happens. So from the last time, we just got up to the dusting fields, so that's where we'll be here. And if I remember correctly, we need to talk to uh, Mr. Freebear up here, so we'll be doing that. We'll be doing that as soon as we've fought these flans. Take care of these flans. These guys aren't like that easy, so you've actually got to be quite careful. It's important to get Phantom BB to do all of his debuff so that they are not as powerful basically. Very important, Gloom Balloon. And I've got one of these mini Reapers here, he's taking care of the random uh, killing. So that's what he does. If you got power and defense down, that's a good start. Ice creatures. Guys. Yay! How you okay, let's go and talk to um, Mr. Fred Bear. This subtunnel must be up ahead. However, it looks like something is blocking the path. I'm sure it's nothing that you can't have. I do need to warn you of something though. When you enter a glitched object into a subtunnel, it's possible to find another glitched object inside. That will take you to another subtunnel. Beneath the subtunnel, there may be even more glitched objects there. Wow. Just make sure you never go more than three glitches down. I'm sure that you not sure that you would ever find your way back up. Be sure to always um, search for new chips and bites. We can do that. So I think we should be good enough for this guy. Let me just, oh, no, that's fine. I just want to add Phantom Foxy onto our team because he has some toxic bite things that I would like to utilize. There's Freddy, <laughs> bites. That's not the right one either. Okay, I'm taking too long. We're just gonna fight him, I believe in us. Anytime now. This guy's called Snow Cone. No, he's called Bouncer. Okay. Forgive me for getting your name wrong. Bouncer. Apologize for my incorrect name giving. Did we just lose that? I added a munchie and it didn't work. So he's totally down. Uh, the power. We shouldn't get one of those rainy days on this guy. So in terms of the save file, I think we have almost the exact same characters. I didn't, I didn't try to make it, I didn't try to do that, but it might happen, it's good. And I have a new hard drive now. We definitely need that power on back down. That would be good. I want to sure, um, he's the most important character on our team, this green guy. Blue Balloon. Can't be as powerful. Now the munchie works. I think that was a glitch before. Put a munchie down, nothing happens. Snowball does quite a bit of damage. But we do have this blue guy up here. He will stop really bad things from happening. Yay! 
Yellow and green, Chica and Phantom DB. Chica heals and Phantom DB debuffs. That's a good combination. And then we got these two for it to fight the Phantom. Mm -hmm. Cold. Uh, there's a problem. I think we'll beat him. Like, look, look at his health. He's gone. A little bit of um, epilepsy for you guys there. I think there was a warning at the start of this game. Loud bright colours or whatever. So, um, this is the mine over here. Oh, and this is the glitch entry. I'm gonna go on the mine just quickly, just cause I can. I'm not gonna try and get the clocks on this series, cause I missed one of them <laughs> when I um, read the save file, but it's no big deal. If you guys really want to see the clocks, go and check out some other. I'm sure there's thousands of YouTube videos on that kind of stuff. So just go and check that out. Shall I have to say? Take care of these guys. We do have Mr. Phantom Fox here right now. He is um, unscrewed. So does the other balloon lady. Small chance of instantly killing the creature. Not so bad though. Oh, they're not ready for that yet, are they? No, definitely not. Okay, so let's make our way over to that glitched object, shall we? We are in the glitched object. And from what Fruitbear said, we need to go down a couple of levels. So we'll do that, because we follow Mr. Fruitbear's instructions. Oh no. Two ways to go. I hope it's this way. Oh no. No, it's not that way. Because Mr. Fruitbear wanted us to go down two levels. Ah, this is the way. We're down two levels. This is what it looks like. The music's getting a bit slower. Okay. Ah, yay! We made it out. Let's hope we made it out the correct way. So this game finds pretty well coming up to its third year anniversary, pretty crazy. Uh, and the, the entire series as a whole has been around for ages now. Anyway, here's Mr. Freebear again. You've reached Lily Gear Lake. From here, I don't know where your adventure will take you. You should be keeping your eyes open for another glitched object. There are the only way, these are the only ways to get to places that are otherwise unreachable. Be careful in the waters of Lily Gar Lake. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a terrible sea monster in this lake. He's a big pain in the butt. You will die a hundred million times. I've, I've played this game a few times before and he's like really bad. Anyway, let's die to him. Let's. Okay, that's not too bad. At the start of this game, it's really grinding. Like, the first three or four worlds. You only barely survive. Especially, and then you hit this water place, and it's like insane when that guy attacks. So you do. I really don't want to be seeing him today. I don't want to. See, I don't. I just don't want to see him. You know? Just kill instantly kill my entire party. I think we need to buy some more bikes. That's on my to-do list. That will mean we might not die. Oh, that's that's the problem. Um, yes, yes, this is a problem. 
Something just going badly. Come on, guys. Yay! We lost. Not even to Seagoon. Told you, when um, Mr. Green Guy's gone, it's a problem. So, these two are good. These guys are good. Yeah, they'll do. They'll do. Let's see if, how much money we have. I think we should need to buy some more bites, Kitty Winks. Oh, we actually have like 500 bucks, okay. I think we need to buy some bites. I'm trying to think with the, what ones we need. There's that base counter one, that's always good. Might as well do one of these um, fishing adventures. I'm so fond of. I can't remember if I do. Do I, I do I actually do well on this with you guys? I don't know. Might as well just do well now, and then I can say that I do well with you guys on this. Um, let's just put one of these here. Yeah, that's good. So I, I do well with you on these guys. If we're not clear on that. New time now, Fink and Chica. Right, that's good. Let's buy one of these. Oh, these are cheap. Hmm. Okay. Good. So, we can use that other money for a slightly more expensive one. I know there's another one coming up in the, in the graveyard. So, oh, that's going to be good. If we can like smash it out to the graveyard really fast and get that one, that would be good. Let's see. Oh, I might as well fight this guy too, actually. Yeah. That's right. It's a lot easier than I remember. A lot easier than I remember. Oh, that'd be... That'd be John Skin, my sorted 5 months of Green's character. Oh, he's gone now. Down there with a swipe of a foxy hook. Right, back to blue. I would like, we want to get down to the grave place as quickly as possible. Okay, colossals, not the worst thing in the world. But there are four of them. So that is more than a normal amount of colossals. To be a bit careful what happens there. We really need sludge. We need a character to sludge and get all three of those down. I can't remember if we ever got one of those in episode 2. I don't think so. Okay, there's balloons we have hot cheese, because that would be something I needed to have it. Okay. Yeah, one of them's dead. I think that was the instant kill guy. We've got this, good, this uh, neon boss up there now. That's going to be helpful, somehow. Feeling a lot better with this one here now. Um, the other guys. Crab apples. I think we just killed that guy legit that time. They don't want to go, they're not ready for that. They're not ready for that action. Ooh! He got rid of one of them. Oh, rude. Need that rainy day in here. Very much. Where did these things went off? Wouldn't it? That would be just great. That would be a nice thing to have. He doesn't want to go. What the heck? Don't 
helped to beat that head, they just giant killing this one. There he is, there he is. We killed that guy legit. It was one of the neon walls. Oh, painful experience though. No challenges? I'm not really that excited about the challenges today. That squid guy's gonna turn up. You guys haven't seen him yet, but he is the worst guy. Why is this locked? Why is this locked? That is ridiculous. Is it because we haven't done the sea guy yet? They probably want us to meet that sea guy. I reckon that's it. We have to beat the sea goon or whatever it is. That's stupid. I don't want to die for these guys again. I am comfortable. One of them's dead, and I bet that was an instant kill. He wouldn't die in the ceiling. Fun to think better, isn't it? Yep, there you go. 400 experience, pretty good. Alright, while we're here, I'm gonna exploit the secret passageway, which you guys may or may not know about. Okay, we're officially in Black Tomb Yard, but I did it the slightly cheaty way. I just wanna go in here and fight some of the um, slightly more advanced. Like perhaps with the grave weed here. Just to get us a bit for that quick go. A lot, lot faster than I would like. Can I? Faster than I. No, I would like it to go faster. Let's take it down. So if we can get some of that good money, like 18 bucks for one grave weed, that's good. New challenger! Huh? Oh. Pay for pounds? I didn't expect to see you here. These guys I would love to have, because they have a certain attack called Mimic Hill, which doubles every attack you do, and that would be very handy right now. So, he's not dead yet. Let's just have a quick switch. I'm just raging them, I want them really bad. They are one that I would like to have on my team. I'm not gonna be snuck into the black tomb yard. I always knew that was gonna be a good idea. Could you not kill my people? That would be something that I would like. Yeah, switching teams is not a thing ever in hindsight. Anyway, we still got Balloon Boy and Balloon Boy. They're um, there. And we can hit them with balloons. If they would die soon, that would be good. That would be handy. I don't know, guys. Do you think we'll get it? Like, it's gonna be close. They have a lot of health, a large amount of health, and I do not have a large amount of health. I have 12 health, which is not a lot. No. No. I want paper pals. Why do you have to do this? They better just die. That is what I need. Could you just die? Just die, that would be great. 
That would be really good. I don't like this. I don't like it. And I'm dying. I don't like it at all. We still got pretty here, so it'll be alright. No. Paper pals. Paper pals, why do you have to do that? Those paper pals, guys. It's unacceptable. Anyway, I'm going to end the episode here. Um, if you guys liked it, uh, then you should like subscribe and like and all that kind of stuff that you're supposed to do. And next time, we will um, do a bit more on this area because these guys, I like these enemies. They're more powerful and... Then we eventually won't get into Black Tomb Yard, Black Tomb Yard legit. We'll have to fight that stupid um, squid, but if we have more chips and money, it, it will help. So yeah, see you guys next time.